Welcome to Hoya Hospitality and welcome to day 11 of Vlogmas. Today we are going to be making a cranberry popcorn garland for this little Christmas tree. It's one of the last Christmas trees that I need to decorate. Um, I had Michael help me string the Christmas lights on because I'm not very good at that yet. So it's really nice to have a partner who helps me in all of these little shenanigans that I get myself into. So. Um, so what we need for the garland is cranberry, popcorn, and thread, and scissors. And I have a little piece of tape on the end of my thread instead of um, having to tie it off. Because I think, per, per Michael's suggestion, is doing it halfway with the pattern and then doing the taking it off and doing it the other half. So I'm not having to push the gar the popcorn and potentially breaking it all the way. The length I have it is about a yard, I would say, or three feet. Okay, so I'm just gonna start doing this. Um, so I will insert the needle into the middle of the cranberry and hopefully it will come out the other side and these cranberries will just dry onto the thread. We're gonna do one cranberry for five popcorn. I had it laid out here so that I could visually see it because I'm a very visual person and I wanted to like have a, see, and it broke here. So I'm gonna take this one out, add a new popcorn from my bucket. And I'm gonna continue doing this. Is there any traditions that you guys do that you guys wanna share in the comments? I would love to read about them and learn more about your guys' traditions. Cause this is Michael and mine's first year being married. So we want to form new traditions for our family. and I'm gonna to try to string this onto the Christmas tree. to keep it really simple and clean but I think that this tree is gonna look pretty bare if it's just one yeah probably need a second one final product guys it's the garland wrapped around the tree and it's stuff that we had lying around uh, the cranberries was from the sangria and the uh, pop puri and the popcorn I just had some popcorn and we had these string lights that Michael bought okay so I'm gonna clean up now and then we're gonna move on over to doing the advent calendar for vlogmas day 11 and we are back with the cheese advent calendar and it will be the day 11. Age Red Leicester.
Do you want to taste test, Michael? Age, red, light tester. Yeah. So age tester. What do you think? Yeah. We haven't had this with one yet. Waiting. Mm. I really don't know. I like um, 3.3. Mm. You know, a lot of people say that anything under a five is not palatable. So you need to rate it higher than that. <laughs> is it 3.3 .3 out of five or 3.3 .3 out of 10? Out of 10. Oh, so it is not palatable. Okay. We're gonna do the 2020 advent calendar for Lego. And for day 11, it is right here. And it looks like it's a chimney with a stocking. Time lapse. It's a chimney with a stocking on the top. And then there's a couple of extra pieces to make another stocking and something to hold the stocking with. For the 2022 advent calendar here, I think it's the pensive where Harry gets all of his memories. Or should I say Dumbledore's memories? extra pieces and that's all I have for today thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one bye